Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix Forza Horizon 3 troubleshooting guide step by step. And I'm um, going to share with you what worked for me, what I've tried myself. So I hope it's going to work for you as well. I can't guarantee you, but I hope it's going to work. I'm just honest. Can't say it's like going to work 100%. So now let's jump right into the video. Let's dive right into this tutorial. So without wasting any second so what worked for me is i had just head over to windows updates and this might be a very simplistic simple um, just obvious thing but it's not you know just make sure you check you you update your windows because this can some sometimes can fix the problem but there's also another thing that i like to do is to go head over to advanced options and here you should see here usually tons of a huge list of updates, driver updates that are, that are just waiting for you to you don't want to install. If you click here on optional updates. Here you should see a huge list. Uh, usually this huge list is related to Windows, to games, to just just to mm, work. Okay, sometimes will not work if you don't have the you don't have the drivers the correct drivers okay so make sure you check all of them and click on download and install okay <clears throat> now the next uh, step let's go device manager here and in device manager make sure you update your display adapters updates search let me pick select your driver click next or you can also click on search automatic for drivers and that's it but there's another way you can also go to geforce experience if that's what you have if you are a nvidia user click on drivers and here click on check for updates and then click on the download if there is available a driver available now there's another way as well here what you can do if you have an amd click on download this will auto detect if there's any available drivers for NVIDIA users, make sure you install automatic updates, driver updates, the uh, GeForce experience I just showed you recently. And also, if you are, if you want the work to, if you want the game to work properly, make sure you install Microsoft Visual C++. Click on the 64, click on it and install. And install, and then DirectX uh, end user, make sure you click on the download button as well. Download button is here. Click on the download button, select language and direct end user. Click download. Now click on the open this file. Click on agree. Next, install. No, we don't want Bing Bar. And just click on next. I'll just cancel because I already have it on my computer. And click on this as well. And click on agree and install. Okay. I hope, guys, this video is going to help you. And also for Intel users, click on download and um yeah that's pretty much what you have to do now there are other methods but i just decided to share with you what worked for me so yeah thank you for watching guys and please make sure you leave your results in the comment section i'm really curious if this worked for you as well thank you for watching and take care